Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. My name's Abby and today I'm back for another what I eat in a day video. I'm currently on a weight loss journey, but I'm no longer tracking anything. I'm not tracking points or calories. I'm just eating how I feel. So hoping this works, but we're going to give it a shot. Um, it's been going, let's be honest, I've been really going up and down on the scale for the last six weeks or so, but I feel like I'm still trying to balance out the not tracking aspect of this. So I still have faith that it's going to work and we're going to just stick to it. Um, today's Tuesday. I went to the gym this morning. I got my second workout of the weekend. I worked out Sunday morning before church and then I went this morning to workout class and I plan on going Thursday to workout class. So that'll get me my three gym days. And what else? Is there anything else I need to update you on? I don't think so. My weigh-in, I if you remember my last video, I said like I wasn't quite sure what the scale said because I saw like 168 and I was so annoyed that I didn't even look at what it was. Like I didn't know if it was 168.2, 0 0.4, I don't even know. But when I got on the scale to weigh in this past Saturday, it was 166.6, .6, so I did come down some, which is good. Um, and I'll be honest, the last two, three days, I wouldn't say I was eating the best. I, did, I didn't do horrible. I did not binge. That's another thing I'm working on is not binge eating. And there was a, like last night and Sunday night, I was like, you know, you really shouldn't color your square for the my 50 day challenge I'm doing for myself because you ate too much. But I was like, did you binge? And I had to rethink and I was like, no, I didn't. I just ate a couple extra snacks than I normally would or normally would like to. Now I know I can't eat like that every day and expect to lose weight, but if I have a day or two during the week where I just have a couple extra snacks, that doesn't, it's not the same thing as like binge eating. If you've ever experienced binge eating, it's like this whole other part of your brain takes over and you feel like you just have to eat everything. And yesterday, um, part of my brain was like, order Domino's, get some pizza, like really go for it. And that's what I used to do back when I was binging. I would order Domino's like all the time. I would go to McDonald's all the time. And I was like, you know what? I don't really want Domino's. It was just that bingey part of my brain. And then I was like, no. Nah. And I just reeled it back in. And I feel like that's a way bigger success than not letting myself have a couple extra snacks. Like I feel like I'd rather let myself have a couple extra snacks than totally like binge and give into those feelings does that make sense i don't know but that's the, those are the things i'm trying to work through and i feel like i have to tell myself like i was telling myself yesterday you can eat whatever you want you can make that decision it's like i have to retrain my brain that nothing's off limits um you know there's going to be consequences if i eat a bunch of snacks every day then i'm not going to see the progress on the scale that i want to see but i also need to tell my brain like anything you can have anything because when you restrict that's when the binging happens. Like if you restrict for so many days, at least for me, then that's when I would binge. So to rein in my binging, I am mentally telling myself I can have anything I want. And so when I give into it, it turns into just one or two extra snacks versus like a full on, like I'm gonna eat all the things. So I feel like that mentality, I don't know, it's been really good for me. So I feel like I'm making progress, I don't know. I feel like every time I say that, then I backslide a little bit, but. I don't know I'm still feeling good mentally and I'm happy and just feeling so much better so I don't know that's my little life update um I'm going to go make my breakfast really quick it's a little bit different but I'm gonna get it made and then I will show you what it is all right friends so here's what I'm having for breakfast today I did kind of like a homemade McGriddle just a sausage McGriddle when I go to McDonald's I just get plain sausage McGriddles and I was craving one the other day so I just thought I'd make one at home. Uh, so I went to the store and got the turkey breakfast sausage patties and I made two Kodiak pancakes. I put a little syrup in the batter before I cook them and then I just do this and eat it like a sandwich. I will check in with you next time I eat something. Hi. Hello. I don't know. That cookamelon might be loud. Um, I can turn the volume down on my phone when I watch them because I can hear them from in here. I just can't see them. Um, it's nine o'clock. I'm drinking my Alani. I'm drinking the second half of this, what's it called? Witch's Brew that I started yesterday. So, energy drink time. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna get back in there. Everybody's fine. The um, babies are just, you know, using their voices, stretching their lungs. 
that's what I like to say whenever they're like screaming and just making loud noises. They're just practicing their talking, so. It's cute. Three of them are wearing pink. One of them's wearing white, so we're close. We were close to having an all pink day. Let's see what the other, the other two aren't here yet. We'll see what they're wearing, but. Okay, we're fighting over toys now. I got a Hi! It is about 10.36 to be exact. I am eating a yogurt. Uh, this is the strawberry cheesecake. Um, yeah, that's all I have to report for right now. Um, the kids are playing. We are going to go play on the back porch today. Oh my goodness, so Friday. I was all ready to like get the kids on the back porch. I had all their shoes on. Coats. I don't know if we wore coats. We, I think we did wear coats. I can't remember. But and we, I walked outside with all of them. Mind you, I had one four-year-old, a two-year-old, and one, two, three one-year-olds, and an infant. She's almost one. <laughs> I had them all outside, and I had to bring them all back in because the porch was wet because it rained earlier than it was supposed to, and I was like... Are you kidding me? And they were so mad and it was so annoying to have to like drag them all back in. But we came back in and we did circle time and they all love doing circle time. So it was fine, but I was just like, that'll teach me to check the porch before I take the kids outside. So I am gonna go check the porch, but I think it's fine. It hasn't rained at all. Um, so that's the plan. We're gonna go play out on the porch and get some fresh air. It was a really nice morning yesterday. So hopefully today goes well too and we I'm gonna have them clean up in about 10 minutes and then we're gonna go do that. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go eat my yogurt and I'll catch up with you later, bye. Hey guys, um, just finished up the kids' lunches. I'm having my collagen drink. 20 ounces of water, two scoops of collagen, and I did Kool-Aid, grape, grape Kool-Aid <laughs> drink flavoring. And um, I also took my greens and the elderberry gummy vitamin. Um, I just did the dishes. I'm gonna go clean tables, get out nap beds, put lunch boxes away. I have to fill up a bottle, change diapers, lay out beds, read a story, and then they'll be down for nap. And then once they're asleep, I'll be back for lunch. It's just a little bit of things, right? Not too much. Um, but I'll be back in a second to show you what I'm having for lunch. Bye. Hey friends, it is about quarter to, actually it's almost two o'clock. I thought it was quarter till two, it's like five till two. Um, the babies are all asleep. Um, I went in and edited my video for tomorrow, which would be out now. It's my pumpkin muffin recipe. Go check it out um, if you want. Um, we had a really good morning, really minimal stress. Everything went well. We were able to go outside. The kids filled up their cleanup chart, so they got a prize out of the prize bin, and I actually filmed their cleanup time today on TikTok, so go over there and check that out. Um, but I have my lunch already here, so let me show you what it is. I'm having peanut butter and jelly. I took a bite out of that because I'm also filming a what I eat in a day for TikTok. So excuse the bite, but it's peanut peanut butter and jelly. This very go-go squeeze and some Cape Cod kettle chips. Um, that's it. That's lunch. I'm going to go in there, relax. My video's uploading from iMovie, and then I have to upload it to YouTube. But I'm just going to chill. I feel like I'm really getting a lot of stuff done. I have... Lots of videos for TikTok. I have um, these videos going up this week. So, I don't know, I just feel like I'm on a roll. I'm feeling good about my social medias. I don't know, yeah, just feeling good. So I'm gonna go eat and I'll catch up with you later, bye. Hey friends, it's about quarter after five. Daycare kiddos are all gone and I made my dinner. Let me show you what it is. All right, so I haven't had an egg scramble in a while so I thought I'd make one of those. I don't have any spinach so it's exactly the same as I've made before, but just without the spinach. And then I did a bagel with strawberry cream cheese. There it is. Um, I think I'm going over to my dad's tonight to hang out. And I will take my dessert with me. So I'll show you what that is before I leave. But they're supposed to text me. I think they have football and band practice. So they're supposed to text me when they leave practice. My brothers are, not my dad. But, so hopefully they remember. If they want to hang out with me, they'll remember. So I guess we'll see. Hi. Hey guys, so I am headed over to my dad's house and I'm gonna take with me one of my chocolate chip pumpkin muffins that I made in my last video. Check it out if you haven't already. Um, I don't think I'm gonna eat anything else while I'm over there. I'm really full from dinner still and it's six o'clock, but if I do, I'll insert a clip here. Okay, I'm back. I'm gonna end out the video. Or maybe I didn't go anywhere, maybe I didn't eat. Um, 
but yeah that's all i have for you guys today um i really been feeling good um i don't know what to say feeling good hopefully it shows on the scale we'll just we'll see what happens next week but that's all I got for you guys, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and leave me a comment down below and press that subscribe button if you haven't already. Also, come find me on TikTok and Instagram. Um, I post videos on here every Wednesday and Saturday, and I'll see you next time. Bye.